well, it's an interesting traditional like three o'clock in the morning might as well come up and see the castle there. Uh, it is, you know, kind of wasn't. Uh, well, this thing I've nicked that sub phone yet. Too heavy for him. I've taken the gearbox out. Yeah, I wasn't kind of expecting them to have uh, nicked it unless they have a problem. Yeah, they might have problems starting it. Obviously, yeah. Yeah, I mean, don't know whether the gearbox is still in the backyard because they've nicked the bonnet, the doors, and um, the rear sub from it. It's not quite as big or heavy as that one. Yeah, anyway, if they haven't nicked that one yet, they obviously don't want that. I've taken the gearbox out, but I came out yesterday, the day before, and there's a cat sat right there. I was thinking, what's he doing there? And usually they're sitting under the engine because obviously it's nice and warm, but that one hasn't been started for a while. Anyway, put the thing down, does it? Yeah, I've got the door. That's security. See, it's the gearbox, it's still Tailgate's still there, all 10 kilos of it. 10 kilos, that means all flipping glass. Ah, it's still there, the gearbox. Uh, the seats were a little bit second hand down now. Took them out, but uh, took them back when the driver said one to bits and can't put it back together. Oh, the bike hasn't been nicked. Took the, no, the lid, I think the lid blew off the bike. Shave. If I put it back, it landed on the end of his bike. I don't think it is handling any damage, but it kind of wrecks that, that bike shed now. Anyway, uh, I'll, I'll keep getting complaints about the yard and the front garden, but I never do it about this. saying, oh, we're going to bring a skip and take that away, but they never do. Actually, one bloke, someone bloke said he was going to come with a skip and empty my house, but if he takes my racing bike, he'll go in the skip first headless if he does, considering how much it costs. But yeah, it's a bit second hand that bike should now, but nothing's been nicked, I don't think. For a while now, I've realised I've about run out of money and can't afford to have else nicked yards. One sec there, one sec there. I was going to put a, is it around? It's inside. I took the bits the this and life motor and everything. And um, yeah, I was got some sports seats because it was, it was twice the power output of the original engine, so it was going to corner a bit harder. But I'm not sure what's going to happen now because I don't know what the doctor's going to say about my fitness to drive. But if they don't, oh, oh there's a spare, there's a spare engine. Yeah, what was it? 300 quid for that. Um, yeah, it's only done 99k. It's a runner. It runs well when they. I don't know what it is, it wasn't working, fuel pump or whatever, but there is a loose earth wire on the fuel tank, but I don't think the engine management computer will find that. But I don't know. It's like, it has more of a mind of its own than anyway. Yeah, it's a bit cold in that. I'll better sure up and go in. 